My review for The Flash Season 8, Episode 2, titled Armageddon, Part 2 is here, finally. Fine, I know it's one day late, but remember, I can't watch these episodes live. I had to watch them on the CW website, and my god, was this easily the best episode so far. I loved this episode. And this is exactly what my Marvel vs. DC YouTube TV show is going to be like. Almost exactly like this episode, the concept, and yeah. And I feel like this episode, even though it was very similar to Supergirl Season 3 Episode 2, but it was, but that one was done so bad and so poorly. This one was done brilliantly because it actually give, gave me a sense of what I actually think could happen in Part 3. So when... And by the way, there are going to be spoilers in this video, so look out for that. Um, because with the our new meta of Zotar, um, basically mind control Barry, Barry show Barry some futures. Well, not only futures, but man, was it a great episode. Um, Barry was is slowly losing his mind. That is something that actually interests me. Because my show will also have Barry kind of losing his mind at certain points. Not a spoiler for my show. In the slightest. This this is not even a spoiler. I mean, a show called Marvel's DC, you expect at least the characters to lose their mind at least at some point. I mean, they've lost their mind in the comics on many occasions. So, you expect on a film and TV to do show the thing. Anyways... Um, even the drama was very exciting and actually felt directly perfect. This is the type of drama I wanted for Season 7. Not that Tom Holland MCU Avengers drama where it's just unbearable. Just because they're arguing for literally the stupidest or for no reason at all or just for comedy's sake. Man, my god, I am loving this season so much. Um, now the question is, is, spoiler alert for those who still have not seen it, is Joe really dead? I don't know. Now, I, I can clearly tell that was clearly Barry just stripped going crazy because Flash Season 7 ends in July. And so, Joe was around at that point. I saw some pictures and videos and clips of Joe in season seven, I can clearly tell he was still there in season in the end in the season finale. So it says to me that no, he's not dead. Maybe this is just Despro tricking Barry, or maybe this is a Ghost Rider Barry, or maybe Punisher Flash. Mmm, this could be tricky. So I'm in high. So anyways, what is my overall score? A Meaning 10 out of 10 or A plus. Um, thank you, Eric Wallace, for this type of storytelling. It definitely feels like you're in control. This is the type of stuff I wanted last season. And I know you've been getting that criticism nowadays. But man, you've really been improving um, for this season. Um, in my guy. So thank you for this. This, uh, I just hope you continue to deliver us episodes like this. Never deliver us any episode from like season 7. Unless if it's like episode 4 or 5 from season 7. I'll, I'll buy it. But any episode from season 7. Unfortunately, no. Okay. Anyways, A, A or A plus is my score. What was your score? Did you like this episode? Do you hate it? If so, leave it in the comments. And make sure you like that this video, hit that share this video with your friends, hit that subscribe button, and turn on the notification bells, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!